Hello, today I'm going to be showing you an amazing monarch butterfly lab, the only monarch butterfly lab here on the University of Michigan Central Campus. My name is Deidre Mitchell and come along with me for a lab tour. Our lab is located in the Biological Sciences Building located in the University of Michigan Central Campus. Here it is connected to the Natural History Science Museum where members of the public can come and visit and get an inside look on the daily research that is being conducted here on Central Campus. Science here is made very accessible for both members of the public and students. Here on the ground floor, there are various meeting spots and study spots throughout the school year and even cafes. On the right, we see posters from previous and current students who may be participating in research internships or programs that require a poster to be made. Many of the labs located within the BSB proudly display posters on the walls and the corridors. Once we make our way through the molecular bench brick area, we can then find the elevators located in the back of the building. These elevators take us all the way down inside of the basement where our basement laboratory space can be located. Here we also have a space in the growth facilities chamber where we house milkweed and milkweed seeds. Inside of the warm chamber we can find more milkweed growing as well as caterpillars, some oocytes also known as butterfly eggs and as well as adult monarch butterflies. Here in the green lab with Dr. Andre Green, we study the monarch butterfly and many of its mystifying behaviors. These past few summers, I have specifically focused on migration, both genetically and behaviorally. Here, I have come to learn how the monarch butterfly is an optimal organism for studying ecology and evolutionary biology. We have been able to close the life cycle of a monarch butterfly for many decades now, with all of its life steps known in detail. All of these life stages can be observed in a relatively short amount of time in a laboratory setting. We also have sustained a food source where we can grow milkweed here in our own warm chamber. For me, my science over the last couple of years has incorporated many parts of having a green thumb and animal husbandry. Both of these things are very important and for me as a scientist, I have come to love an equal balance of both this type of field work and molecular bench work. For every scientist, it may be different, but with SDB, I have been able to come to know what sorts of scientific pathways are best suited for myself.